Hello, Sagittarius, and welcome to Your Future, Your Life, the Planet Waves mid-year reading for 2022. My name is Eric Francis Compolino, your astrologer and friendly neighborhood investigative reporter here with what I have learned studying your solar chart. Uh, this reading is supposed to be for the second half of 2022, but actually I'm pretty much starting in 2023, around the month of March, and uh, working my way backwards. All the really important uh, transitions toward which all of the current astrology is leading do take place in the month of March. There are several uh, major transits and planetary sign changes, including Pluto and uh, uh, Saturn and and Jupiter is also very active throughout this time, Jupiter being your ruling planet. And so I'm uh, doing, doing my best to, to handle all of this uh, holistically and to view these influences all acting upon one another. I think that the, uh, the most important turning point uh, in the year 2022 is going to be Mars retrograde in Gemini. Mars retrograde in your all-important relationship house, your seventh house, Gemini, the house that's associated with partnerships in, in all of their different forms and also the environment in, in which you live. And I think for Sagittarius, this is a transit that has to be handled with the utmost care and caution uh, which is because it is in such a prominent house in your chart. Let me let me show you uh, how that looks in a moment. Uh, but before I go there, let's just make a little more room for that chart. Before I go there, uh, I want to acknowledge, as I'm doing, if I remember with every single sign, that we are living in just these very difficult and tragic and uh, sad times. It is stressful right now. Uh, even if one is doing well, there is the constant stress of change and of uncertainty, and it is difficult uh, to be forward-thinking. It is difficult to have a sense of the future. It is difficult to plan in any way. Um, we are, in many ways, being compelled uh, to stay in the moment and to um, lo look after ourselves in a, in a very immediate way, and yet yours is one of the visionary signs and y you know you are inherently a person who is uh, connected to what is possible and uh, to y your own sense of, of your potential uh, perhaps more than any other sign <laughs> 